A little bit about me, man. I just uh, just turned 23. Um, yeah. Try and lose weight, man. Try and lose weight. Cuz I'm cute and I'm on TV and I'm having a lot of sex, I'll be honest. And you don't really know who you're gonna get pregnant. You know what I mean? Like, I was thinking one day, like, what if, what if I get a big girl pregnant, right? And then the baby grow up, start to walk and run, and we can't catch it. <laughs> we'll literally be unfit parents, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like, like how would I fill out a missing person report? <laughs> Sir, when did you realize the baby was missing? I'm like, immediately, immediately. <laughs> I was right there behind him. I was like, stop, son, stop, son. <laughs> he didn't know his name was son, so he kept going. I just couldn't. Well, why didn't you stop him? Because I ran out of breath. <laughs> I almost had him. Then he stepped on a mushroom like Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> Jumped on Yoshi back, and it was over. Like, oh, like, oh. <laughs> Two big people having sex is fun. It just don't sound good. <laughs> sound like a whole bunch of wet handshakes. <laughs> like a locker room full of high fives. Hey, good game, good game, good game. Like, I think they won the championship in there. <laughs> I like to smoke weed, man. I like to smoke weed. Can't smoke with everybody. I choose who I'm gonna smoke with based on what kind of snacks you're gonna have when we get out. <laughs> I got this white friend named Timmy. Had to put him in the Hall of Fame. <laughs> First time we smoked together, he pulled out some Lunchables. <laughs> Messed me up, because I didn't even know you could eat Lunchables at home. I thought you had to be in school to eat Lunchables. <laughs> I ate two semesters worth of Lunchables at his house. It was amazing. Third and fourth grade, it was crazy. He had the pizza Lunchables. Remember the pizza Lunchables? You felt like your own lunch lady. You be talking to yourself, I'm gonna put the sauce on it like this. I'm gonna spread the sauce with the pepperoni. I'm gonna bedazzle the cheese on this. I don't even know what bedazzle mean, but I know you got a bedazzle the cheese. I used, to be a, I used to be a server at IHOP. I used to work at IHOP. Um, you know how hard it is to smoke weed, be big, and take orders? <laughs> Felt like me and the customers was always having foreplay. <laughs> they sound so sexy. Or they'd be like, um, I would like the pancakes. I'd be like, what kind of pancakes? They'd be like, buttermilk. I'd be like, ooh. <laughs> Then they get aggressive, give me two eggs, scramble with cheese. I'm like, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> provolone cheese. I'm like, provolone? <laughs> I ain't never did it with the provolone. <laughs> <laughs> People so judgmental. You know how hard it is to be my size and be a server and have to tell your table y'all out of what they want? <laughs> Automatically my fault, no matter what it is they order. <laughs> I had a lady order turkey bacon one day, and I'm like, you know, ma'am, I'm so sorry. We're all out of turkey bacon. She gonna look me up and down. I bet y'all are out of turkey bacon. <laughs> like, bitch, I don't even eat turkey bacon. I like regular bacon. Make your blood pressure go up. Gotta get your foot cut off. That's the bacon. <laughs> Just cause something's on a, on a menu don't mean you gotta order it. I hop sell T-bones, but if you don't have health insurance or a strong immune system, <laughs> I wouldn't recommend it. I had this lady order a T-bone one day. It's the arrogance she had when she ordered it that made me mad. She was like, um, yes, I would like the T-bone, and <laughs> could you tell the chef I would like it medium rare? A dude at another table said, did she say chef? I was like, yeah, dog, she tripping, hold on. <laughs> I got this, I got this. I'm like, you want your T-bone from IHOP? Anything other than well done. I need you to sign this health waiver for me. The meat was damn near spoiled when we got it. We didn't even get it off a truck. We got out the trunk of an 09 Honda Accord. And it ain't never been a chef at IHOP. It's a brother named Breon back there. He didn't study abroad? No, but he killed abroad. <laughs> Y'all been fun, man. I'm not losing